So we're here, welcome. Uh, we're at Creative Social Presents. Uh, we're on the couch once again and the pleasure of speaking to one of tonight's uh, presenters. So uh, introduce yourself, please. Um, I'm Alex Lemon. I'm a content strategist by day and by night I make biscuits. Fantastic. And uh, why do you think it's important for people to have influences or outside interests beyond their day jobs? Um, because that's where your ideas come from. If you don't have interests outside that you feed, then you've got nothing to take to the office with you. Um, you need to be a whole person to come up with good ideas. So yes, doing things outside that, that you just feel happy doing and feel kind of relaxing is definitely uh, important. And what are your outside influences? What are you going to be talking about tonight? <laughs> I'm talking about my little baking business, um, which combines my, uh, my love of, of baking good tasting things that aren't fancy um, with my love of creative swearing. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that, yeah. <laughs> and um, do you think employers take enough uh, responsibility about encouraging their people to have outside interests? And is it important? Um, I don't think they do, actually. I really don't think they do. Um, I've worked different places. I haven't necessarily worked in as creative environments as maybe some of the people here do, um, so I can't speak for those ones. But a lot of the environments I've worked in, um, there, haven't been, there hasn't been a lot of encouragement of doing things outside or bringing ideas from outside or just using a bit of your daytime to explore something interesting. That, and sometimes you get the talk that that's what you should do, but you don't get the time. Um, uh, and one, one of the clients that I work for um, is quite encouraging of, of giving people some space like on, a, on a Friday towards the end of the week to explore you know, what they're interested in so that that then feeds into the things that they do for the company and it's really effective. And for anyone who's, I don't know, like work-life balance or something, they're a bit frustrated about how much time they're getting to spend on their hobbies versus long agency hours. How have you juggled it and what, what sort of insights could you give to someone about that? Um, I found it very difficult. At one point I, I was working a job that um, required me to, to be in the office about 14 hours a day, sometimes seven days a week. Um, and it actually put me in a very bad place. I was quite ill because of it, quite stressed. And um, the way to get away from that was actually just to change completely what I was doing. Um, and eventually, a couple of years later, that led to me going freelance, so I had complete freedom. Um, not everyone can do that uh, because of money and, and trying to get up the career ladder and things like that. But if, if something is that bad and you're not enjoying it, then just get out and do something else because it's not going to change. Brilliant. And um, your, what's it called, Biz Stunt? Biz Cunt. Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought we were going to try and say. But can we follow you on Twitter or, or uh, come and check out your cakes anyway? <laughs> yes, you can follow Biz Cunts. They're at Biz Cunts. Um, or you can follow me. I'm at Lemonosity. That's awesome. Thanks so much. Okay. Source LF are London's leading creative communications and media recruitment agency. Be sure to like our video and subscribe to this channel. Take the moment to watch another of our videos on screen now.